what's up y'all y'all i've been meaning to pick y'all up all day and have not what's wrong with me i was just about to start cleaning the kitchen up putting the food up <clears throat> and realize <clears throat> excuse me i was supposed to tell y'all what i was cooking i wasn't gonna show you what i was cooking because this is nothing new i just made some meat sauce and uh spaghetti noodles a salad and some tuna fish that's gonna be our little meal to take us through the next couple of days but i've been slipping do you hear me slipping so um yeah here i am welcome back to another video <laughs> um so for tonight i cooked spaghetti and meat sauce i i uh made some i actually made some fried corn as well wanted some fried corn and then i made us a green salad and then we had tuna we had tuna well i didn't have tuna but i made tuna that way we can have for lunch or snack or whatever the case may be for the week so that's what i've been doing i came in from the grocery store put up my cold items didn't even put up everything cleaned myself up and got to cooking okay so got that out of the way I chill, sat down, watched a little TV for a minute, did a little work on my computer, talked on the phone forever. <laughs> Lord, me and my brother talked on the phone for almost three hours. Uh, yeah, so I've been doing that. So now I need to get these uh, the food put up in the Tupperware, wash these dishes before I kind of wind down for the night so I just want to pull y'all up because I have not pulled y'all up I felt bad I could have been had a whole video by now all the stuff I done did all day <laughs> all day um I know I went out to the store earlier and when I tell you our heat we have a heat advisor going on and it was this lady that uh, saw us outside of the store and she wanted to stand outside the store the store and talk in that hundred degree weather i said baby call us we, we we got to go call us it's too hot to be standing outside the store talking but yeah i was just popping in need to get this stuff done in order to get ready for our work week so that's what i'm about to do so let's get into it salad dressing I discovered that I like. Sweet Honey Catalina. It's really good. That and I've been on to Thousand Island lately. I'm like, I'm a balsamic vinaigrette ranch girl. What's gotten into me? But hey, I'm always open to trying new things. This is one of my new things.
right, y'all. I was about to put these up, but I wanted to pop in and show you what I had. My auntie gave me this stuff. Don't you just love it as an adult for you to get free groceries? <laughs> My auntie was like, honey, I went to Sam's and I got all this big stuff and I don't need it all. So I got me some chicken broth, some grits, some evaporated milk. Then she hooked me up with some, um, what is it? Instant grits with, with country bacon. I ain't never had that. And then I got different types of oatmeal over here. So thank you, auntie, honey. Free groceries for the win. <laughs> I love it. I love it. But let me put this stuff up. I'm probably going to take these packs and stuff to work, though. That way, in times when I don't take lunch up there, which is most times, I'll always have something to grab along with, like, my tuna that I have up there. Water, Gatorade, stuff like that. So, yeah. I think I'm going to pack this up and take this to work. All right, y'all. I came into the Habitat for Humanity restoration store coming in here to see what they got it's like a store that has like refurbished things that you can purchase so just doing a little walk through to see if anything catches to my eye today like this chair says 30 bucks This sofa says 30 bucks. Hmm. So, this sectional is nice. $225. It's not good lighting in here, so let me walk through and see what I can see.
All right, y'all, it's lunchtime. I got my bread here. I got my tuna fish that I made the other day. <laughs> and I'm about to make a sandwich. Thankfully, I made this tuna fish. I really just wanted to have something light. So I'm about to have me a tuna sandwich. Um, with some potato chips. That's what I'm about to eat for lunch, honey. And in this tuna, I just put mayo. I put eggs, relish, um, like season it to taste. And then I added a little sugar. And I think that is it. I might add a little, you know what? I think I got a little romaine. Add a little of that to my sandwich. Since I got it, add a little greens on there. And it's just some chopped romaine mix that I had made a salad with. And you want to get your greens in whenever you can, as well as not waste your food, okay? So, let me show you what it looks like. This is what it looks like. I'm just going to cover this up just like that. Let me get my chips out. I think I'm going to use some sweet heat uh, barbecue chips. And this going to be lunch.
Okay, as you can see, I am labeling my foaming mousse products. I recently just got my labels in, so I'm like, I've been waiting on them, and I need to get these products labeled so I can get these products on the shelves and get them shipped out. So, I decided to uh, go ahead and put these on. It's kind of late in the evening, but I needed to get it done. So, sometimes you have to work late, you have to work early, but you have to get it done when you're working with, um, you know, a small business. And uh, you're pretty much doing things yourself, which, like me, that's what I do. But I love what I do. And um, I'm just happy to be able to produce these products and see them work for my customers and my clients. Um, I can say, though, as I'm um, watching myself or as I'm doing these labels, I thought about in the beginning when I first started my product line, I was so meticulous as far as... But I'm still meticulous but as far as being a perfectionist and just wanting every little thing to be right and I had to learn that everything is not going to be perfect um, even though I may want everything to be perfect it's not going to be perfect and that's okay that's okay um, I feel like if I would have waited till things got perfect I would have never started so I'm happy that I push past my wanting things to be you know just right and perfect and I just got started and I'm learning as I go that things will just fall into place you will you know be able to tweak things you'll be able to um, improve things as you go so that's what I learned because you have to have a steady hand when doing these labels and if you don't you may get something wopsided or off but that is okay the product in the bottle still works just as fine so um, if you haven't already, y'all, check out my product line, HD Essentials. It's always linked in the description box. And I am finished getting these products labeled, so I'm about to call it a night, okay?